So, I was trying to not do this video, you know, but then me I gotta do it anyway because me see, say certain things are, are, are heat up. I don't know if this is for promotional reasons only. I don't know if this is actually real life anything. So somebody just linked me and them say, yo, so flow TV. Me write it down just as them say. See me pen and paper here. Them say, massacre this gully vendetta link. I say, a Gaza genocide. Right? So I'm this, I, and me say, okay, where did you see this? They sent me a link and the little video clip where say, Some boy I talk about this and that, but I, and him say a Gaza genocide at the real link. Now, what I'm gonna use that to segue into is this. I remember, right? Go and look it up, or I'm gonna give you the link for this video where he did massacre was on um, Magnum Live 2017. Like I said, three times in our performance. One time he called. Whoever over there, some body dread. When he said to the people, if no one confuse the people, them, there's only one Jenna, right? The rest of them are some body dread. So, I don't want to get it confused. There's only one Jenna. Run it. We go post the meta. Don't rock the nigga on the top. I don't know. Who's in the back? Who you know have dreads where say Jenna, Jenna, and Jenna all the time? Fort Jenna. And who sings say, I know Jenna, Jenna that. Alright. So, I'm saying to myself now, also he went on again in the same performance to say, Jenna and a genocide, right? A one Jenna and a genocide. So the other Jenna, Jenna, them don't mean nothing. So basically he said, one Jenna and a genocide. 3.49 more in a video, I'm saying, I don't want to get it confused. There's only one Jenna. All right, check it out. There's a show coming up called Best of the Best in Miami. I Look at the lineup of this show. If you missed this show this year, you are crazy as a bat out of hell. Look at the lineup. By Centennial Park, which, by the way, SoFlo TV, Brains and the Beat, will be at the park from 12.30 to 1.30, 2 o'clock. Just to meet and greet whoever want to come out and meet and greet us right there outside the entrance gate before we go in. Right which part on the pick up on the ticket and stuff before we go into the park. Once we go in at the park, the only way y'all going to be able to chill out with me and say nothing is if you're in VIP as well because we will be heading off to the VIP. So, the meet and greet is right out there. So, matter of fact, go check Brains and the Beat channel because she have a list of all the parties that we're going to be attending while we are there in Miami around this entire Memorial Day weekend and you can also link up with it, join up with the part of them. Alright, now, on this show, on this show, best of the best, the lineup is sick this year, right? The lineup is crazy this year for best of the best. What is going to happen there though is, you're going to have Massacre sharing the same stage as Idonia, sharing the same stage as um, Mavado, right? So, when you are here, a man, I say, some pussy I talk about Gully Vendetta, a genocide, Gaza. Alright. Now you have to go share the same stage with... If you look at the lineup, you can see that Massacre is going to be there, you can see Idonia is going to be there, and you can see Mavado is going to be there. Vendetta. Not Vendetta but Gully. It would be good to see Alkaline show up there and surprise the people them. But if anybody else was added to the lineup, like any big name worth mentioning, right? So here I am, I'm clicking on it and I'm gonna tell you who's gonna be there. Because I'm looking at the flyer right now, give it some time to pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. And I'm gonna tell you who I got there. Then I'm gonna share the same stage. My thing is this, a lot of people are concerned because they say, yo, if Massacre this Mavado, how would I look backstage? 
and how to look on the stage. If you this, I don't you like that. How to look on the stage and how to look backstage. I can tell you that this format, best of the best, I've been going to best of the best for the past 10 years. And the thing is, if I'm not deployed out of the country on some military mission or something, I'm always at best of the best, right? I was there the year before last year. Last year I went with Brains and the Beast. She was the winner of the SoFlow TV Crush competition. And that was a part of one of, um, one of the, the things that you won. Right? So I went there with her last year. The year before that, me get Fissy Spice go up there, go throw a word with um, Mumasa. Because them did a squabble about something about some girl lady so come out and say something about some, some girl a follow me. Come take her shoes past stage and all that sitting here and fling off her shoes and start perform like she always do. Then Spice came up next and Spice addressed the some girl issue and I talked about some of them are going like them own take off shoes and fling off her shoes too. And they are kind of up there, right? So then you had Alkaline up there and Footer Hype style up the man bad. Before the man performance, he come up there and come talk up some something about anybody in our of Gaza and Free Vibes Cartel and Ray Ray, the place lift up, right? I was in the crowd. Then him said a few chosen words, rinse two vibes cartel tune, and then bring out Alkaline on the stage. Alkaline get some heavy boo out there that year. Jano, the youth try him best, but him just couldn't stand up to the best of the best crowd. That's what I'm saying. It's, I think it would be a good look to have Alkaline back this year because he surely has raised his stock. And I'm sure him wouldn't get them booed this year. Now, on the stage this year at best of the best, my thing is, will it be war or will it be peace between the artists, them speaking of Massacre, speaking of Idonia and Mavado? That little something right, that's up, right? Because Massacre talk things about the man them out of road must be some kind of implication when them touch a stage. Unless he's under some heavy security team. You know them celebrities, they do it already. My entourage here, your entourage there. and But the man them from each other entourage that always start the drama. Like, yo, Jenna, me bossy me in face to you, you know. And yo, my youth, you can't talk to my general, them way there, you know, and poof, cough, quiff, and them things that go on. Is it gonna be that? What I would like to see, though, SoFlow TV, I'm gonna want to know. Leave your comment in the comment section below and tell me if you would like to see the same thing. Would you like to see a clash? Or would you like to see them come on the stage and throw words at each other? Or would you like to see what I would like to see? Because this is what I would like to see. I would actually like to see Mavala come out on one side of the stage or I don't come out on one side of the stage Massacre come out on the other side of the stage show the people them see a unity and strength we are dealing with you know how big this would be for dancehall music in front of a crowd like these thousands of people that will be in Miami at Bayfront Park at best of the best May 28th of this 2017, I'm plugging the date again, 12.30 to 1.30, outside of the gate, meet us there, so flow TV brands and the beat, link up and meet and greet. Alright, do you know how big that would be for dancehall music? May I say it again, Massacre come up on one side of the stage, I don't come up on the next side of the stage, or I don't call out Massacre during his performance. Or Massacre Carlo I do it during his performance. Show the people them say, yo, when you hear lyrics are just lyrics. You know what I mean? I say, when you see them kind of beef there, it's a competition thing because dancehall is very competitive. But in a real life, once a Jenna and once a fourth Jenna and a Jenna Jenna and fourth generation are a lucky place and them kind of, you know how the crowd would lift up? Do you know how big that would be? I'm telling you, right now, um, people that book these people for shows, Promoters would be calling from all over the globe immediately. This would be something unprecedented in dancehall reggae music. But, of course, our people now going to take it to no time soon. And there I am being skeptical, but at the same time being hopeful. The glass is half empty, always, always half full, right? What we want to do is like, comment, share, subscribe, talk about things in the comment section. Tell me if it would be a good look. If them actually unite on a stage like best of the best and shell down the place. Tune for tune. Or if they must keep this thing going. Because I don't hear I don't hear responding or maybe me death. But me know some massacre throw a word here and here and everywhere. Right? Not only at um, not only at um Mavado's team, but to mature it at Alkaline team as well. And surely somebody are gonna get a response somewhere. 
Is it going to be a lyrical response, physical response, on stage, off stage, behind stage? There is more to come to this, I am sure, and we will hear about it. It's Soflo TV, man. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Leave your comment in the comment section below. As usual, I'm a part of here. Peace. And don't forget, be there or be square. A beer front park was set the 28th of May, 2017, from 12.30. We're out there at the entrance. And after that, zoom. I'm gone, we're gone. All right? We're out. Oh.